Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. This is Christine with a K and today I'm going to share you some of my beauty tips that I do usually once a week. Um, I do it usually every weekend so because tomorrow is Friday so it's weekend time so today I'm going to share to you what I do usually um, if I do my beauty spa thing so actually since I have a mixed type of skin oily and dry and then I have a very sensitive skin so it's really difficult for me actually to to use just any brand um no offense guys i mean everyone is you know it depends also on the skin type that you have so for me um that's one of my issues actually in buying a beauty products for my skin because it's just ah it's a little costly actually it's really costly so um so what do i do my, to my facial was uh, I have been using this one, okay, uh, for almost a year, and this is a Swiss image uh, from Switzerland. So it's all skin types. If you can see here, here it's all skin types. So it's a uh, whitening care. It brightens my skin. It cleans. So uh, it it has with the Alpine Glacier Water, Vitamin B3, and White Ten Complex. So. It has, uh, it really suits in my skin. So, as you can, I don't have a perfect skin, but you know, it, it, I'm happy with it. I'm happy with this. So, I'm using this. This is the first thing that I do. Um, I'm doing this for every morning and every evening. But when I do the my beauty regimen every weekend, I'm, this is the first thing that I do. And then just a little, okay. And then you rub it, and then like this. So if you can see, there's no really a bubble thing. I remember before when I was teenager, uh, of course it's adolescent, so your changes in the skin, you know, pimples are coming up. Um, I'm very glad that my skin doesn't have um, my face doesn't have that pimples but my pimples guys usually uh, is coming up at my back or in my shoulder especially uh, before my period comes it comes out so um, I the better they said like um, more less uh, foam it's better on your skin so yeah this is just how it works in me yeah also you have to do the your neck so that it ha you know the skin tone that you have in face it's also balanced to your neck yeah it's just like that a little rub yeah and that's all so i'll wash it i'll rinse it It's really some here, even though you will not put it in the hot temperature, normal one, but still the water is still warm. Yeah. I'm okay with it. So I can actually um here in Oman uh of in every store's supermarket it's available, but I'm not really sure in the like in the Philippines, I think it's also available in supermarket, but not the soup. Let's say not the regular supermarket because probably the price, this one is double the price in the Philippines, especially it's coming from Switzerland. So that's why if ever like um, um, going home to the Philippines, I'm buying an extra activity. So, so here I can give you actually the uh, how it works here in your skin. So so it deep cleanses without over drying it removes excess oil dirt and impurities 
reduces dullness and visibly visibly brightens, gives even tone and radiant complexion. So that's what we need actually. So it's like this. So one next, I'll just dry my. Okay, you just have to dry part it, okay? And then, yes, see, um, I don't know if you can see it, but I have, uh, I think everyone does have a black, uh, what do you call this one? Um, black heads, sorry, we have black heads, so I do have black heads. Um, since you know uh, in abroad actually guys the going to spa is expensive so but if you're like in Asia in the Philippines so you know you don't do I don't honestly I don't do these things when I'm home when I'm in the Philippines or even in Asia I go to a spa because we have to admit that the spa in Asia is really affordable in our pocket but here in abroad it's very costly and especially now it's pandemic the spa and salon are still closed because of the direct contact to the client. So, uh, what I do to remove this um, blackheads, I bought a nose chip. So, I bought this one in the Philippines. It's very affordable. Actually, I bought this one in the one, the Watsons. Yes, I know it's in Watsons. So, the per box it has 12 it have it has 12 strips so it's really it really removes the i sorry it really removes your blackheads so it helps removes blackheads draw out impurities absorbs oil and dirt helps unclog pores so what we will do actually of course i have dried my face right so in this area of my nose i have to put water to wet, to wet it because the strips okay this is so it has 12 packets inside so each of this i'm going to remove this one okay this is how it looks like okay so okay i'm gonna show you yeah so this is how it looks like so of course this is the bottom and this is the top of your nose so definitely when i start remove this one it will not stick on my nose if it's not wet so i have to wet this part remove this one and stick on this yes as i was saying okay so we will okay we'll wet my nose the entire my nose so that it will stick the, the strip so this one i will remove it okay so the black portion should be below okay so it's like this okay to press it so that hmm. yeah so it's like that okay yes so we have to wait for 50 10 to 15 actually 10 to 15 minutes uh, they have mentioned here but what I do so that to make sure all my blackheads will be removed I'm waiting it for 15 minutes so I'm going to do a timer 15 minutes yeah so for the meantime okay uh, while waiting for the 15 minutes I'm thinking to do something uh, well, so that you will not be bored actually I'm thinking to do uh, there's a uh, um, never ever i have this portion so i'm there are, there are several uh, statements that i'm going to answer yeah so let's start okay guys so we'll start the never have i ever questions okay the first questions actually i just have a random questions here so i'm going to read it okay this is the first time i'm going to read it and i will see what will be my random answers <laughs> never have i ever got a tattoo 
sorry i don't have a tattoo and i don't have plans also to have a tattoo i mean i respect those guys those who have a passion and having a tattoo it's it's an art it's it's their thing but it you know it doesn't work for me okay next question never have I ever stood someone up on a date no i mean i always respect guys if if uh, i have a date definitely and, and if i have confirmed that date i show up i mean i mean i mean people the person uh made an effort so it's it's not my thing guys <laughs> anyway next never have i ever had a speeding ticket <laughs> i'm guilty i'm guilty guilty with this so I don't think, I think most of the people that I know who's driving, I mean, I'm sure they always have, they have experienced at least once in their lifetime to have over speeding. <laughs> Next, never have I ever ghosted someone's text. He guilty. Oh, I'm so sorry. I, uh, it's not actually text because during those years, it's, it's not, um, text is not really a thing it's um uh, and that time i was trying to avoid also to know that my number my personal number so yeah i'm so i was too young that time and uh, unfortunately i was not ready to have really a really uh to level up this re the relationship so yes i did it <sighs> next Never have I ever lied to get out of going to work. Never have I ever lied to get out of going to work. Yeah. It depends maybe on situations because if there are some urgency that you need to get out, then I'm guilty. Yes, I'm guilty guys with this. So sometimes I have to get out for some emergency reasons that doesn't concern uh really to work but it's just that i need to go out yeah uh. <laughs> next never have i ever given a fake name no it's let me remember no i did not i didn't really give a fake fake name because actually i have two names christine michelle so if if i don't feel like i'm not going to give you people who how they people called me christine so i will give you my second name because they're not familiar with it uh general people doesn't have it or i'm giving my chinese name so it's like that so it's, but i never yeah i i never give up I'm given a fake name next okay never have i ever dumped someone over text <laughs> yes i did i did dump someone over text but i have a reason guys because uh i don't want to prolong and uh you know because i'm a kind of person sometimes i'm very impulsive <laughs> it's just that yeah it's just that like that uh i need it i need to tell in the true text so that you know to avoid wasting time because i don't want to spend another second time of 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 a moment that he's gonna think like you know um of what he feels towards it towards me so I'm just being frank. Is it bad? <laughs> Next is Never have I ever been sick on public transport. Been sick on public transport. Actually, um uh, airplane does it considered public, right? <laughs> I think the far remember yes, um because you know guys me if i can manage my body to go i will definitely go um the clear mind that i could share to you remember i was um i was on holiday in seoul that was like what 
six years ago, I think. So, on my last few days in Seoul, I felt sick. Maybe the f I was food uh, poison, and my flight. And good thing my flight was on the evening. Imagine, so I was like, uh, there was a part of my mind that you know I need to stay for another night in Seoul. But you know, changing all go these things in the last minutes, it's gonna cost me. But uh, I was so lucky that uh, I just stayed for the whole day and my last day in the hotel you know to make me feel better and luckily when i reached in uh, the airport in the south Incheon airport my seat has been upgraded to business class so i was able to rest actually for the entire flight so that's it that's the thing that i could i was so lucky <laughs> next is never have i ever tested an ex out of nowhere to be honest with you guys um I'm still, I mean, not all, <laughs> but there are some people who are worthy to be connected with my past. So, you know, once in a while on a special occasion like their birthdays, like special occasion Christmas or Eid. So, you know, just a simple normal greetings because, you know, um, we have to accept the fact that there they were once part of your life so no grudges like that okay next never have i ever done a nude streak streak in public definitely no 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 my god i can't i can't carry myself i can't imagine myself that one next never have i ever kissed and told kiss and never have i ever kissed and told i think all of us are guilty about this so I'm guilty with it. I mean, I'm being honest here. So judge me. It's up to you on how you judge me. But I'm just being honest. And um, next. Never have I ever been refused entry to a club. Mm, I think when I was in the States. Because see, Asian people actually look younger compared to the American. When, you know, they think that you're still below you're still minor so yeah i did i experienced it one day they were they even have to check my id yes so i think that's the part one of never have i ever questions so it's time for me to remove this one okay i will show you is it like yeah that's time so it's just easy you just have to remove it ah oh my god how you can see it not that much i don't know if you can see it okay those white things mm, yeah there is a lot if you actually if you can see this like this one that one yeah you can see so what you do this one you just have to put water to remove yeah. this is charcoal actually yeah so i'll just wash this one okay I'll see you in a bit. Now I already washed this. You can see it's clear already. Mine's no spot. So the next step is I'm going to have a mask, clay mask on my skin. So I'm using this one, L'Oreal. L'Oreal. So it's a pure clay mask. So it purifies my skin. So. Um, a little bit like after that I feel like um, my skin is tightening but of course I need to um, just you know I, I just use my hand and scatter it okay my skin of course and also your neck you know guys you have also to take care of your skin especially it's our skin face is really exposed to the dirt every day yeah so that's why if other it's called maintenance we have to you know if machine have maintenance how much more as uh, people yeah so 
Macam cuba awak saya look Young, beautiful Yes I can feel also I can already feel already dah Later on, I will go to in front of the You just have, you know, give your eyes, of course, definitely. Just only like around your eyes only. Yes. And after doing this one, actually others like do it twice a week, but for me, I just do it like once a week. Yeah, I think I'm okay. So for this, it's also 15 minutes. I leave it for 15 minutes and wash it. Yeah. So that is the part that I have to relax my face for 15 minutes. So, I'll just come back after 15 minutes, guys. And there is a last part, thing to do. Of course, we do have dark spots under our eye, right? And we have, of course, to, if we cannot remove it, at least we have minimized it. So I have a thing that I'm doing it here, later on, yeah? So it's time to clean my face. So I'll just wash it. I'm too little sorry so that I can remove that, okay? You just have to guys, you just have to really clean it well, okay? Especially this kind of wash. So that you don't know, you don't have like this one. So, uh, girls will always be girls a lot of things, you know. But I know there are some guys who do that, but you're very, it's very fetish. Um, yeah. Wow. It feels great actually guys. I feel like after the whole week of exposing yourself outside with the dirt and of course not to mention your stress also. So yeah, actually guys those who have stress, having stress. You know either the impression is to do this thing. So that to be feel Fresh! Ooh. I, I mean guys, if, I, I mean I'm not saying that you also have to buy what I do because as I said earlier, that it depends on your skin so you can, you can do this also and you can just choose the brand that suits you, okay? Yes. and kick it with skin it's clear now yeah so the last part we will do is I will put some strips here I get my eye see? at least see to less the darkening spot under my eye so now we're on the last part of my beauty regimen so, of course, we have to take care of our eyes, especially the dark circles here that we have here. So, what I do, I have this eye mask, okay? I bought this one in uh, Thailand shop here in Oman, okay? 
so I decided to buy this one because it has uh, 60 pieces inside so I can save on this rather than usually I'm buying every you know, pack um, it costs so when I found this one it's called Dr. Rochelle 24 karat gold collagen hydrogel eye mask so it's brightening and firming improve wrinkles and fine lines anti puffiness dark circle relieve and reduce skin dullness so this is my secret guys so um this is how it looks inside actually this is like this and then they have this little spoon here wherein you can because you see this is how it looks inside see so i'm just going to take two okay and put of course under my eye and after i forgot to look this okay mm, wow yes mm. feels good one more okay here yes so yes not really that too much in the eye just a little bit okay so that's how it is so after that one of course please make sure that you have to cover it so that it will not it breaks through the gel inside after the spoon so it so it will stay here for 15 minutes again. Now I can feel now the, the coldness of the eye mask that I have. Yes. So that's it guys. Um, hope you have learned something from my beauty regimen. And uh, you can just, uh, I know, uh, do it once a week if you're lazy do it twice a week but for me it's only once a week but of course um, you have to do your regular skincare in your face as I said that uh, our skin needs also to be maintained so that you will, you will look beautiful young and stress free <laughs> so please uh, to those who watch the video from the beginning until the end thank you very much and then if you haven't uh, this is your first time please subscribe to my channel click the notification bell so that you will be notified whenever i have new videos thank you ciao